Hello friends, my name is Raza Masood. Today we'll discuss about the topic uh, Microsoft Word editing text. Friend, today's topic is very easy to understand, and uh, I hope you like this video. Uh, today we will uh, see this topic in detail that how we can simply add text in Microsoft Word and how we can edit it. So first of all, let's start. First of all, I will request to please subscribe to my channel and click on the bell option as well so that my new videos can reach to you. So let's start. Uh, first of all we have to open the Microsoft Word so very uh, very simple just uh, go there at on the start button click uh, st on the start button on Windows like this uh, just find out the Microsoft Word there like this is Microsoft Word available just click on that so you see that it's opening um, so Microsoft Word has been opened okay now this is the window of Microsoft Word uh, how to create a simply a document in Microsoft Word like just click here on this button office button uh, you will see the new button new button just click on that new button so you see that uh, new blank document is available so just simply uh, create click on create button so in that way you can see that you can create a uh, new uh, document so this is the procedure this is the uh, way to create new documents uh, okay now uh, just simply uh, for example just add some text here through the keyboard like test document okay so I have written test document now uh, friend uh, this is I have added simply a text here in the word document now first of all we have to see that how we can save a uh, document just click here and see this is the option available save so click on save um, here it is giving you an option that uh, where to save the document uh, you can just give some name for example test document and uh, you can save it like on the D drive okay so just create uh, file name is test document save as type word document and you can simply save the document so in that way simply you can save the document also uh, one uh, important thing you can do like you can save as as well save as mean friend uh, you are also saving the document but the main difference here is that you, you can save it with a different name and also you can save as in a different word uh, format as well like word 97 uh, like word uh, uh, 2003 um, uh, web page so different options are available by using save as type you can save it in a different format as well now coming toward our main topic like editing text in uh, Microsoft Word uh, first of all see just add the text here now uh, friends see uh, this is the uh, ribbon available here uh, in the Microsoft Word like just select the document to just select this document uh, click on the left mouse button and uh, drag it so see this is the way to select a document just click on that way you can select the document what is the way click on left button and drag the mouse in that way you can select the text now see here for character formatting uh, these are uh, these are the font styles are available uh, there are multiple font size are available for example uh, Calibri is available so if you click on that see this is the uh, font size set for for the text uh, you can set Arial as well so see this is the text Arial has been set um, another type is that so in that way you can so whatever the text you will select uh, you can um, you can select the font style accordingly uh, okay so you are noticing that whenever I am selecting the font style so I can change the uh, text style as per my uh, knowledge as per my uh, requirement you can also set the font size as well you can see here for example in that way whatever the font size you will select uh, in that way you can uh, you can do the font size as well other another thing is that here uh, you can see that bold is available like if I do that bold italic and underline okay 
in that way if you want these are the options available for text editing bold uh, if you just uh, uh, double again uh, again check so it will revert back the changes see if I click on that underline this is the underline this is the italic and this is the bold okay then um, so stripe the text for example uh, you have written something in the document and you want to stripe out like you want to mention that it has been removed or it will not be part of the document so you can use uh, in that way as well other thing is that friend um, very important like uh, you can use the highlight for example you can see and that uh, this is the highlighter if you uh, just want to highlight some text in the document like for example you want to highlight that in the yellow document so just click on there on here so you can uh, highlight it this is the highlight option uh, second thing is that friend if you want to change the text of the color uh, like for example see in that way you can see from here like okay so you are noticing I hope okay, you are noticing that the text uh, color is not changing whatever the you want to change the color in that way you can change it um, another very important uh, thing is that for example you can use the uh, bulleting as well uh, sorry alignment as well like right now it is uh, left align it is the text is left align if you click on that you can see it is centrally aligned it is uh, text right align this is the right align and this is the justified justified we normally use when we are doing the when we are paragraphing the things and we want that paragraphing the spacing among the paragraphing should be adjusted so that's why we use the adjustment normally we use uh, left align central align and the right align so these are the very common uh, practices we use uh, then uh, bulleting is very important bulleting how we can use the bulleting let me give an example here for example uh, test one test and test 4 now friend you want to use the bullets here so how you can use it just first of all select the text similarly uh, left button click on the left button and drag it okay in that way you can select now select the bullets just see there are multiple bullets available you can see from here these are the non numbering bullets okay uh, non numbering bullets whatever the bullets you want to select just select it and you can see another bullet type like uh, numbering is also available so see these are the bullets you can use for numbering when you want to uh, bullet use the bullet by using the sequence or numbering you can use these bullets if you want to uh, like uh, use the bullets without numbering so you can use these bullets uh, so friend uh, I hope you like this video, video. Uh, then uh, what you can do like once to save the document just save it okay control s is the short key and then you can close it in that way your document will be closed and then you can close it and uh, exit word this is the uh, proper way to close the document Okay, friend, thank you. Thanks a lot for your time and uh, that's all from my side. Thank you.